What's up, AK family? It is day three in our field trip to the airport. If you're new here, you might be a little bit confused. Let's do a 30 second recap. So we planned the trip of a lifetime for our anniversary to Italy with a stop in Paris so we could go to Disneyland. Well, our flight was delayed twice and then it was canceled. Delta rebooked us for the next day and put us in a hotel and it was bad. And I mean real bad. So we booked our own hotel. The next day we went back to the airport for our flight and it turns out we were on standby and we didn't have actual seats. So we missed that flight too. But at least Delta put us in a nice hotel this time. Now we're back to try for the third time to catch a flight. And that's what you missed on AK Adventures. <laughs> Let's get back to the video. We are still at the Atlanta airport two days later waiting to get on a flight so that we can get to Rome. Yes. So. And I have a good feeling about today. Okay. I have a feeling about today. It's going to be a great day. And in the morning, we're going to be in Rome. We better be in Rome. We we're going to be, be in Rome. So as of right now, Listen. our flight is about to board in a couple, like maybe 20 minutes, and they're looking for two volunteers. Right. You guys, like we, st we don't have a seat number. We, currently, we do not have a seat number. I don't know why. And yeah, listen, y'all tell me if y'all have ever experienced this. They overbook these they overbook doggone flights? flights, and then when everybody show up, oh wait, we didn't expect everybody to show up, so we'll put y'all on the next one. And then the next it. one is overbooked, and then we'll put y'all on the next one. That's what's it's a domino effect with us right but now. But to be honest, if if somebody got to get pushed up this flight, it don't need to be us. Right. You know what I'm saying? But. With all that said, we still have high spirits. We Aaron has high spirits. I smile all over my face. He Kyle does. Has his Come on, smile for me, babe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm so over all this. Got to remain positive. If this is your first time seeing us, my name is Aaron. Her name is Kyra, even though her spirits is low or whatever. We are AK Adventures, and what we need you to do is subscribe to our channel right now. Hit that subscribe button. So, follow us along. I just want to get on the flight. We both want to get on the flight, but. We'll see what happens in the next 20 to 30 minutes. Thumbs up. Y'all see that plane? Listen, we gonna, listen. We're getting on that plane. One way or another. We strap our seatbelt tight enough. Do they want to see a Karen with some extra stop, melanin stop, today? Because I will stop. bring it today. We're sitting here waiting. Boarding is about to start in like five minutes. I'm sorry if I look crazy. We just checked our apps. So Aaron just went up to the counter for a status update because our apps were still showing no seat assignment. And Aaron just went up to the counter and the guy was just like, you're good, you're good. So Aaron pulled up the app and we have seats. You guys, look, do you see that? DL1, DL1, do you know what that means? We are in first class. I'm literally about to cry. Like I am the least emotional person. Aaron can tell you. I have no emotions. Rocky Marciano. I have no emotions. No, no, no. My name is Stone Cold Steve Austin. I have that is what Aaron called me. He calls Stone. me Stone Cold Steve Austin. Stone Cold Steve Austin. This really has been stressful, like these past two, two and a half days. I've been sitting over here and my heart has been pounding. Like so and I'm like taking deep breaths. I prayed, I've been praying, and I feel like God was like, I kept checking the app, I thought like God was like, do you have faith in me or not? If you do, stop checking the app and just sit here. Like, that's what I feel like he said to me in my head. So I said, no, I'm not gonna look at this app anymore, and I'm going to trust that it's going to work out. And we're in first class. Are these lie down seats, Aaron? Mm -hmm. We have no clue, you guys. We booked economy seats. Like, I have to call my mom. <laughs> Throw some likes, hearts, whatever you want to in the thank comments you, because Jesus. Oh th my God. thank you Lord, thank you Lord. All right, y'all, we have to do is board. Look at all the people. There's a ton of people on this floor. And we are actually pre boarding. Oh, Jesus Christ, my God. Move over here. Not on our flight. I'm screaming at my mood changing dramatically after we got our seat assignment. But I've been stressed. I don't care what seat we had, but. We got first class. <laughs> and we're sitting together. We were nervous about that too, that we might not be seated together. So, <sighs> I'm just so thankful. All right, they just called Delta One. Let's go. That's us, let's go. Guys, AK family, the moment has finally come. Ready to go? We can confidently say we're going to Italy now. Oh my gosh, are you serious right now? I am the lucky one. Right? <laughs> mm -hmm. 
I would like the window, please. All right, so we've got the remote here. Looks like the controls for the seats. Oh my God, it goes all the way down. We've got the TV here. I'm sure this pops out. And this is the leg space. I have my bag here, but I don't know if this can actually stay here or not. But this is the amount of space. So just me sitting, if I put my leg up, my leg doesn't even touch the thing, but I am not sitting all the way back. I'm 4'11", but I'm sitting at the edge of my seat. In the seat, there is some bedding, and it looks like it's made from recycled plastic bottles. Very nice. And this is the seat. Got us some headphones here. We have short ribs, we have a chicken breast, or we have a vegetarian platter with rice. Okay. She probably like the chicken. I would like the short ribs. Oh, okay. Yes. Short ribs, excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I thought you knew her better, huh? Yeah, yeah. that would have been my second choice. That was, it's only two choices. <laughs> <laughs> it's only two. You get slippers too. You can let the dogs breathe a little bit. Uh, and, and walk around. You can recline. Uh, they have the seat settings. I think she showed you all that. And, and over here we got some outlets, USB and um, European outlet. It's going to be grand. It's going to be right. What do you think, baby? You excited? Like, too big size? You don't know how to act. I don't even know what to do. You know, I, I told you I'll let you see the world. <laughs> oh, <please. laughs> I don't even know. I told you I'll show you the world. I'm looking around like, what is the proper etiquette? Like, I'm trying to act like I've been here before, but I haven't. Oh, my God. We just got our amenity kits. The flight attendant did say that this was supposed to be in our seat when we sat down, but they were waiting for the caterers to bring the food. I'm gonna go ahead and open it and show you guys what is inside. Not me having a place to put the camera. Not me having a, a little a little bedside table to put the camera on. Y'all <laughs> see air chicken in. Let's see what's in here. Oh, I've heard of this brand. Some skincare from the brand Grown Alchemist. It is a hand cream. And there's also a little lip balm in here. There is an eye mask, which I did bring one, but we have another one. Mine is the one where it doesn't lay flat on your eyes, so I'm pretty sure these are earbuds. We have a pen, toothbrush, and toothpaste, and it looks like a bamboo toothbrush. Very nice. Now, this is in my flight essentials because I was not about to go to sleep without brushing my teeth and waking up in the morning without brushing my teeth, but it's very nice that they provided that. That is everything that is inside of the amenity kit. I just can't even believe this is all happening right now. We apologize for the short delay. The catering just had to show. You guys, the buttons. Lemon pepper steppers. Y'all remember, y'all, we all had to go outside, and y'all just grab the shoes by the door, and if y'all grab your sister's shoes, <laughs> that's how your feet is sticking out <laughs> to the mailbox, and to take the trash out, or to get the groceries out there, get the groceries out there. The groceries out the Push this. Oh, stop playing with us. There goes the TV. I think Aaron showed you all this in his seat. I'm not sure. I'm just recording it again, just in case. So there's an outlet here. There's a USB here. And then there is an outlet. It looks like for headphones. Uh, I don't know what this is. I'm not going to sit here and lie to y'all. <laughs> I don't know what this is. I did show y'all the headphones in the beginning, but here are the headphones again. I will put the brand on the screen because I'm not quite sure what it, the brand is just yet. I do have storage space here, so you have a pretty deep pocket, actually. My sunglasses are in here and all the way down, so it's a pretty deep pocket. You have another pocket here. Before we take off, I'm trying to show you all as much as I can. So when you push this button here, the tray table pulls out. This is my first time pulling it out. so. There we go. Aaron, can you show them how you push that down? So this part here, there's a button. You all won't see it on this side. But you push the button and then you can push that down. Oh, We belong here. <laughs> Did you get your own jeans, sir? Did you get your Pinky jeans, get the Pinky descended. Cheers, darling. And yeah, we're honored to be a part of it. Across the globe.
man over here living his best life. I love to see it. So we got a little appetizer here. Looks like apricot cheese and some glazed nuts. And I got a Coke. And they put down this nice cloth. So that's very fancy and very nice. This looks amazing. So we've got some kind of soup here. We have a salad with the dressing. We have a roll and some butter. And then I got short rib and this looks like some kind of greens and potentially sweet potato or yam i'm not really sure veggie platter not only do we get a meal and they just came and took my plate but there are desserts you can choose from ice cream or this pumpkin tart right here this pumpkin tart is Christine. Somebody behind us said that this is the best airplane food that they've had. This is the first airplane meal that we've ever had. So we're excited and it's been like great. So. Here is my in-flight essentials bag. I have a toothbrush, some deodorant, and a mouthwash, and my toothpaste. Asians. 
This is probably one of my favorite movies. Here is part one of my breakfast. Got some fruit here, and I got everything bagel with, ooh, it looks like chive, probably chive and onion cream cheese. I love a bagel. And then I got my orange juice, and then I am just watching She's the Man, one of my top favorite movies. I love this movie so much. Here is my frittata. Looks like it has some herbs in it, veggies, cheese, and then this looks like a hash. But it looks good and it smells good. Oh, boy. I'm just trying to get myself together before we get off this flight. Good morning, everyone from Italy. I can't believe we're here. We're just about to land. In about 15 minutes, it says on the uh, timer. In first class, it doesn't feel like it was as long as it was. It was a nice ride. I'm sure we're going to feel it on the way back. <laughs> because I, I don't think we're going to be flying first class on the way back, but it did not feel like it was a nine-hour trip. Kyra's just getting herself situated. Trying to get myself together. Mm -hmm. It's time to go to Rome. I'll tell you what, I am going to miss this seat. Well, I am ready to get off the plane because we're in Italy, but I have never in my life wanted to stay on a plane longer. Just the most amazing experience. Look at the airport. We are here in Italy. Oh my gosh. Guys, we've just had the best flight that we've ever experienced sitting in Delta One. Definitely recommend it for those who got that extra coin that they can yeah. splurge on that thing. It's definitely an experience. It didn't even feel like a nine hour flight. Not at all. We couldn't even tell you guys how much the flight cost because we did not pay for that. We just paid for main cabin. What a great experience. The food was great. My breakfast was a little cold this morning, but <laughs> The food was still really flavorful. Mm -hmm. The service was great. It was just nice to have so many of those extra amenities and to be able to lay down, it was just, yeah. it felt like you were just in Different a car experience. on a road trip or yeah. something. Like it did not feel like we were on a plane. If it you, was- Listen, if you never laid down on the plane, you, listen, you don't know what you miss. How are we supposed to go back to <laughs> Like, right, listen, now I got, we gotta grind hard so we, right. can, we can stay at this level. We gotta work hard so we can stay in first class. We're super excited for what is to come. Yes. Well, we do hope you guys enjoyed this video. We are now in Rome and it is time for us to head into the city. If you want to see our journey, then continue to watch. Make sure you subscribe to our channel so you can follow along. We have an amazing trip planned here in Europe and you don't want to miss it. Yeah, yeah. So, Love you guys. we will see you in the next video. Peace.